Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and in this video today I will show you complete user setting for Pokemon Violet and Pokemon Scarlet. So let's get started. If you want more FPS for these games in user and and if you want maximum performance for these games in user then go to files and open user folder. First of all guys, you need to check your keys files and make sure you are using uh, latest keys so your keys uh, should be up to date. And I wanna tell you one more important thing over here because Pokemon Violet and Pokemon Scarlet are latest game then you need latest version user early access or mainline build user so you can use any user emulator but you should have latest version if you have an old user emulator then you can face black screen with sound with these games in user now i show you something more and i have different version user emulator so i have main build user emulator and early access different version you can see so i extract uh, this uh, file mainline build user emulator so it's very important guys so after updating your user emulator go to file and open user folder and uh, now close your user emulator and uh, create a new folder on your PC desktop and open this folder now guys uh, cut these all folders from here and paste here so you can use uh, these folders later after fixing the issues for your game now I close this uh, folder and reopen your user emulator now ok and yes and go to file and open user folder and reinstall everything like your crowd keys and uh, your firmware files so if you don't have latest keys then you can get new key from my video description go back and go to NAND folder system and then register now go to NAND folder system and register now copy your all firmware files so make sure you are using uh, latest firmware files so you need all files from here copy and paste here now go back and it's done now close this folder and close this folder now restart your user emulator after updating your keys and firmware files now select your game directory double click here and over here I wanna tell you one thing more very important thing guys uh, do not use XCI file uh, use NSV file instead of XCI because uh, many XCI files uh, uh, are not working in user emulator so you can face low FPS problem or crashing problem with XCI file and for more settings uh, for your user emulator if you want to get maximum performance go to emulation and configuration go to graphics and make sure you are using multi-core cp emulation so you need uh, this multi-core cp emulation and uh, go to cpu select auto otherwise you can uh, use unsafe or auto so i recommend auto and graphics and use vulcan and select your gpu device from here and select the resolution 1x 720p by 1080p and if you select 2x then you can face lagging problem uh, for your games and user so 1x uh, is the best and uh, make sure you are using gpu video decoding default and if your uh, cpu uh, as uh, a you know, gpu then you can select cpu video decoding but I'm using external GPU so I'm using this one a GPU video decoding default and uh, uh, do not use uh, OpenGL 
uh, if you have uh, AMD uh, graphics card so you can use Vulkan and select from here uh, AMD super resolution if you have AMD uh, GPU but I use uh, uh, this one because my uh, GPU is uh, GTX 750 NVIDIA and go to advanced and uh, uncheck use resync it's very important check this option and check it so uh, you can face audio issues if you do not use uh, this option so check it and select from here normal and if your GPU is very powerful then you can select high so you can I try both options from here but I recommend normal and select automatic from here and uh, go to audio and controls and select from here dot if your game is 32 bit then select handheld and if your game is 64 bit then select dot and ok and make sure your settings uh, for user are same for your games right click and go to properties and general multi core cpu and auto and graphics Vulkan and okay settings are the same and guys make sure you are using latest region drivers for your gpu go to search bar and and type your device manager so here's my device manager control panel and uh, go to your uh, uh, display adapter click here and right click so i'm using nvidia geforce drivers properties drivers and i'm using latest version drivers as you can see driver died and if you are using older version drivers for your gpu then please update your drivers if you do not update your drivers then you can face black screen with sound uh, for your games and years old okay and okay and I have uh, uh, some more uh, solutions of problems for uh, Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet in Yuzo then right click go to display settings and uh, uh, scroll down and go to graphic settings and click here and I remove my older version Yuzo and click on browser and uh, go to your uh, user emulator folder so my user is over here mainline build select this application file and options and select high performance and save now close it and go to your control panel for your nvidia gpu right click nvidia control panel now you need some more settings for your uh, GPU so go to adjust image settings and make sure you are using a uh, performance options over here so select performance and check it and apply and go to manage 3d settings and scroll down and uh, select from here power management mode a uh, maximum performance and uh, texture filtering quality high performance and open gl rendering gpu select your uh, gpu device uh, from here and apply and go to program settings and go to add options and uh, go to browser and go to your user emulator folder you are using so is my user emulator folder like this application file and apply and go to configure surround and select your gpu device from here and apply and it's done your settings are complete and make sure uh, your pc settings already done uh, so go to uh, search bar and type your ms config and press enter go to system configuration go to boot options and advanced options and make sure you have uh, unchecked this option so i am using uh, 8 gigabytes memory ram 
so if you uncheck this option so you can use all memory ram uh, after unchecking this option so check it and select from here your pc core so i'm using four core cpu select a big number from here and if your big number is not showing then you can uh, uncheck this option okay now okay and apply and okay and restart your pc now so after restarting your pc uh, you can play your game pokemon scarlet and pokemon wallet in user emulator with maximum performance without any problem and if you want more fps uh, in your emulator for these games then play the game and after uh, starting the game press uh, ctrl plus u on your keyboard for more useful videos subscribe to my channel and like my this video thanks for watching guys bye bye